Temperatures in the 40s on this Wednesday morning. Getting closer, Michelle, to those temperatures and that spring-like feel that we've all been patiently waiting for. Yeah, put your eye on the prize, Pat. Okay. We've got one last day to get through. It's going to be a little bit of a doozy in terms of just being miserably cold and then added to that some cloudiness. So hang in there, though. Look at this <laughs> temperature trend we've got today and then an extended stretch of days where our temperatures will be into the 70s. Saturday and Sunday looking like the warmest of the stretch where inland areas will be close to 80. Right now it's drizzly and cool in Newport. You can see that little bit of rain stretching from eastern New England down across Fall River, New Bedford into Newport and Narr uh, Narragansett and even Block Island getting a little bit of drizzle here and there. That moisture off the ocean going to continue to try to pinwheel in. At a minimum, we're going to get a lot of ocean clouds and then an occasional patch of drizzle or some sprinkles. Our temperatures out the door this morning between about 45 and 50. So 49 in Providence. 45 in Smithfield and we're gusty already along the coastline 20 25 mile an hour wind gusts currently in near 30 for wind gusts on Block Island. The strongest gusts will be this morning. The trend will be for the winds to be diminishing, especially inland areas at the coastline. It still stays a little breezy today with the high temperatures running well below average only in the middle to upper 50s. A lot of extra clouds today and again chance for some sprinkles and drizzle out on the bay. Small craft advisory no longer in effect, so we know that at the uh, Block Island Martha's Vineyard ferries. They've been on canceled the last four days and thinking they've got a decent shot of of getting those ferry back up and running today. This area of low pressure continuing to spin to our south, generating what's been those gusty winds, high pressure to the north. That fetch off the ocean going to bring in some extra clouds for today. So you can see that a lot of the sprinkles and drizzle drying up this morning. Nine o'clock, we're looking at a lot of clouds here in eastern New England, starting off with some sunshine further west, but those clouds will expand westward. So three o'clock this afternoon, cool and cloudy, only 50 in Plymouth, 57 in Providence, close to 60 in Westerly. And that'll be our warmest spot today, about 55 in Newport. And then tonight, hung, holding on to the clouds and some patchy fog, maybe a little spotty drizzle. Tomorrow morning, gonna start off with clouds. So don't be surprised when you wake up to that. About 50 to 55 at 7 o'clock in the morning. It'll be a process, but gradually breaking that cloud cover up to allow some partial sunshine. And you can see the warmer temperatures moving in upper 60s to lower 70s inland and middle to upper 60s along the coastline. And that stretch just getting started. In addition to some warmer temperatures moving in, we'll have a little bit of mugginess returning to the air. It's not oppressive, but it'll be noticeable compared to the very low relative humidity we've had so far this week. So Lots of clouds around and in the 50s for today, then lower 70s tomorrow with clouds giving way to partial sunshine through the afternoon. Friday, small chance of a passing shower, lower 70s, and we'll keep a very low risk of an isolated shower this weekend, but overall a warm stretch expected for both Saturday and Sunday. Better chance for a shower or two with the passage of a cold front late Monday. You can get